Okay, welcome to a new episode of Resolute Fitness. Uh, before I start with, with today, I'm gonna timestamp this um, video. So you should be able to see down below there's different sections and I've put it in the description. So if you just wanna go straight into the workout portion, the row, then just click that. Um, if not, if you're not bothered, then I'm just gonna talk for a couple of minutes and just give you the sort of the background and, and the reason why I did this today. So here we go, it's Tuesday morning. I, um, I coached this morning 5 a.m. and then decided to take the rower outside and do a 2K for time. Uh, 30th of March it is. So I've, those that are used to the channel know that I, I love a, a 2K and I actually did a 2K video just before COVID and I'll, uh, I'll try and put a little link or something or a thumbnail so you can, so you can see. And I think my time then was 6.52 if I can remember rightly. So since then I've, I've not been on a rower during COVID because of obviously I don't, I don't have it at the apartment and gym's all closed and I haven't been I haven't been into a gym since um, since last March and then the past two weeks I've, I've sort of been going to um, this new one the row 2k for time those that are, have done it is um, it's like a, a competitive distance 2k it's, it's hard sort of push but there's a strategy behind it and normally I have like decent pace in every 250 meters to 500 meters and know exactly um, what my splits are um, and I also know where I'm at sort of cardio wise and strength wise and all that stuff but because of because of COVID um, I only know the sort of the pre-COVID Sean so today uh, I bit the bullet I did it I was worried about it because I was thinking if the time is uh, a lot slower than it was a year ago then it's slightly depressing but I also know if I can get a good honest account of where I'm at then uh, then I can build on it and I can start working and, and, and get better before the video starts before the workout starts ah, stay. before the video starts of the, the workout um, yeah, just a little bit of a warm up, sort of like a thousand meters, a thousand five hundred, um, around that of just breaking it up into different bits, like a steady state section. Then I did a few sort of little sprints, practice my start, stuff like that. Um, so the actual workout, I I thought overall the thing that surprised me was my actual sort of cardio. I felt. I felt as though I was good for the for the 2K. I didn't I didn't die. Pacing again. I thought I paced it pretty pretty well. I didn't go too hot. I kept calm. I kept steady and, and tried to um, finish strong. Um, but I think what happened was that my sort of technique has gone slightly. Um, and again, I want to make it clear like my technique isn't perfect on the rower. Never has been perfect on the rower. But Again, pre-COVID, me, uh, my technique was a little bit better compared to, to today. Um, and then just that sort of strength endurance, really. I, I, right off the bat, I could feel my upper arms and uh, those that are familiar with doing the 2K, it shouldn't really be um, your arms doing the work. It should be the, the leg drive is where the, the majority of your power should come from. So, yeah, and I've got the video, so I'm gonna I'm gonna look back at the video. I'm gonna watch it, uh, give an honest assessment. But my time, the time was seven seven ten, and like I said, that last one thousand, it didn't seem to matter how hard I pushed. It was it was just not moving. It wasn't moving from seven ten, where where normally I can kind of control that a little bit better. So yeah, all, all in all, I'm glad I've done it. I'm obviously disappointed that I'm not sub seven anymore, but yeah, I have to, I have to sort of um, eat a little bit of humble pie and, and and work on that. 
and try and get it back sub seven. So I'll keep you posted on that. But positives, cardio, cardio still there, strength is still there, technique is I don't know. I'm gonna have a look at the video. Um, so yeah. But thank you for all for watching this. I've clipped that in there now, and um, yeah, stay safe. Got my coffee. Chill out now. Bye bye. Thank you.